Hello, my name is Erin Cross and I am an assistant professor of art at Doan University in Crete, Nebraska. I want to welcome you to this video series exploring various artwork in the permanent collection here at Doan. Today we will be looking at this print by Georges Raoul. Now this print titled Saint Put and we will discuss the title momentarily, was part of a series of 17 color etchings and 82 black and white wood engravings published collectively in 1939 in a portfolio called Passion. It was published by Ambrose Goulard, who was a well-known art dealer at the time. The print was plate 13 from the series. Now I said it was a color etching, but to be more specific of the technique of etching employed, it was an aquatint. Okay, the image uh, is eight and a half inches by 12 and a half inches and was printed on laid paper. Now, do you see the initials in the bottom right hand corner of the page here? It has been etched and printed from the plate as opposed to handwritten. Now, all but one of these um, etchings was initial, and the other one received the full signature. So you can see that we have the initial version. Georges Raoul was a French artist whose work is often associated with Taoism and Expressionism. As a young person, Raoul apprenticed as a glass painter and restorer. Now, this experience definitely manifests in his unique style of mark making. I mean, look at those bold black outlines and transparent color layerings. They are so vivid that they almost glow as if the sun was backlighting the image. This is absolutely indicative of the stained glass windows that Raoul would have encountered. And this inspiration would be the hallmark of his artwork's look. Okay, so let's go back to the title, Saint Put, which translates into Saint of the Whore. Now, this definitely is a provocative title, but Raoul wasn't trying to be obscene at all. In fact, Raoul was a devoutly religious individual, and his body of work really focuses on the aspects of his beliefs. Even when his subject matters weren't religious, like in his circus-themed imagery, there was still a sense of contemplation on human condition and suffering, and Raoul often chose subjects who were seen as more fringe and undesirable to force the viewer into a moment of reflection and to engage in their own idea of their need for salvation. Now, the Passion series was a story of Christ, and within the story are images of everyday humans, no matter what life path they have chosen. So here we have Saint Put. Is this Mary Magdalene, the, prost the prostitute in the Christ story who washed and perfumed the feet of Jesus? Or is this woman meant to serve as a symbol, as a reflection of ourselves, broken, suffering, living life the only way they know how through sheer survival methods? The eyes are closed and the face is in profile as if turning away, but even in this acknowledgement of, let's say, shame, there is still a sense of personal pride in the upright and grand manner of the figure's pose. It is a bit melancholy and perhaps gloomy, but this is the power of Raoul's work to create an inner reflection that isn't always beautiful, but raw and symbolic and pensive. Okay, I hope you enjoyed looking at this print, Saint Put, by Georges Raoul, and I hope you will join me again for another chat about art from the permanent collection here at Dome. Until next time.